Hi guys, so let's review the Olay White Radiance Vitamin C with Niacinamide Serum. Now, for starters, Vitamin C is actually an antioxidant and when you use it topically on your face, it helps reduce the appearance of dark spots you know, so you have an even skin tone. Now, the good thing about this Olay skincare product is that it contains niacinamide, which is moisturizing to the face. So, unlike other products which contains solely vitamin C that are quite drying, this is hydrating to the face. So, after you cleanse, you can just put this on and apply moisturizer, but you don't have to worry about your face being too cracked. Otherwise, that might happen if you just use vitamin C alone. So if uh, you like use vitamin C serums available in the market um, that contains no hydrating agent, then you'll have to really put in moisturizer. But this one, I've tried it and uh, you know, there are times when you can just use it without actually putting a moisturizer on top of it. However, there is one problem that I have with this product. You know, there's a tendency for me to develop white heads, those little bumps when I use this. So according to the instruction, you can use two pumps twice a day after cleansing your face. So what I did is that I just minimized my usage of this. So it's like once a day or once every other day because it's just the usage of it just leads to white heads, which is not favorable. You know, that's the one thing I like about other products that only contains vitamin C. Even though they are drying, I can just put oil on top of it or a moisturizer and it doesn't lead to white heads. But this one does. So if you want to purchase this, this is actually quite pricey. I got mine from the official store on Shopee. Um, but there are promotions happening on regular intervals. So you might want to avail that anyways so this product comes on this bottle um, it's quite fancy because you know it's white but when you look at it closely it has the these small glitters and you'll see the expiration date at the bottom the expiration of this bottle is on November 2023 it's an up this is a pump bottle so all you have to do to open this is to twist the cap counterclockwise and then you'll notice that the top part of it will be released you just have to just continue um, rotating it counterclockwise until you're able to get it out and then when you want to close it you just put it back on um, by twisting the cap clockwise so the cool thing about this is because it's a pump you can regulate the amount that you'll be using so the suggest the suggested is that you use at least two pumps uh, twice a day so all you have to do is to press the lid after you've taken the cap all right so the product itself is um it has this mild very mild scent and the color is white but there's a yellowish tint to it probably because of vitamin c you know if you pour this on your skin it looks like condensed milk now the consistency is really thin as you can see and when you apply this on your face it spreads out really quick it dries out really quick it's not it's not oily nor greasy it's not tacky so it just spreads out evenly on your face which is a really good thing all right so this version of ole vitamin c is a 30 ml bottle but i believe they also have like face masks containing this product but I opted for this one because, you know, this is really easy to apply. Unlike the face mask where you have to put on your on your face for a couple of minutes, probably 15 to 20 minutes. But this one is quite easy to use. You just clean, clean your face and then put it on and then moisturize your not as 
uh, time consuming as a, a, a face mask. All right, so on the label it says that concentrated formula to reduce the look of dark spots for visibly more even tone and texture in 28 days. Unfortunately, I didn't see any dramatic results. As you can see, this bottle is almost empty, <laughs> but so far I haven't seen any dramatic result. Um, one thing I like about vitamin C is that it dries out pimples but you know this is not as drying as compared to a uh, vitamin c that are stand alone so when it comes to that factor i don't think uh, this is as good as that one but i think that what really is best about this product or what really makes it stand out it stands out is the fact that it's not overly drying on the face Overall, I think the usage of Ole Vitamin C does greatly depend upon your face because in my case, because I develop whiteheads because of this product, I try, I try to avoid using it as much. So I'm on that regard when it comes to Vitamin C, I might have to resort to other products instead, instead because you know there are other products that I've used that doesn't have that much whitehead effects although they are really dry so i really have to put in moisturizer afterwards but when it comes to this only the greatest downfall that i have in using this product are those whiteheads i cannot have those whiteheads so um if you ask me whether or not i recommend this i'll give it a 50 50 because it will greatly depends on your reaction to it or on your skin's reaction to it so just be cautious of that because i also have another person who developed whiteheads and that's not cool